Grandpa? What have I gotten myself into? If... If only I'd have listened to you, then... No, I can't think like that. Grandpa needs me. I have to find a way to help him. That's it. I don't know how I'll do it, but no matter what, I have to find an escape. Anna. Ah! Did you say something before? Who were you talking to? Oh, uh, just talking to myself, I guess. Hmm. Well, stop it. It's weird. And come closer. I've told you a thousand times I can't hear you properly over there. How are you this evening? Tired? Hungry? That's nice. Now listen carefully. The time has finally come for your experiment. Ah, uh, exercise. Yes, exercise. Exercise? See your nice red chair over there? I need you to go on and sit in it. What exactly is this exercise? Just do as I say. Uh, <coughs> that is to say, come along, dear. Nothing to be afraid of. Be a good girl and sit in the chair now, hmm? <sighs> good. Very good. All right. Stay very still now, Anna. Now hop up, Anna. Quickly now. So tell me, do you feel different? Somehow different in your head, perhaps? Actually, yeah, I kind of do. I feel kind of, kind of, kind of sick and dizzy. Those lights were really intense. Oh, curse you, child. That should have brought out your powers. Um... My what? Your telekinesis. Show it to me. Helen can -ness? I know you have it. I've seen it. If he has it, then you must have it. I'm sorry. I really don't know what you mean. I don't have any powers. Hmm. This may be harder than I first thought. All right. All right. Go and pick up your spoon. No, that's okay. I'm not really that hungry. No, not to eat. Pick it up. Hold it out. And then think about nothing except the spoon bending. Well? Come on, child. This seems rather silly, but I think the witch's patience is running out. I better just do as she says. yet. Just looking at it reminds me of the gunk the witch fed me. Blech. Cooking is obviously not one of the witch's specialties. Concentrate on bending the spoon. All right then, here goes nothing. Mm. I don't believe it. What? What did you say? What happened? I 
bent the spoon? I bent the spoon? Wow! Come closer, child. I can't hear you. It worked. It actually worked. I bent the spoon. Show it to me. Hold it up to the camera. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Finally, it's mine. All mine. <laughs> uh, oh. Uh oh. Oh, but I still have so many things to do. So many things to prepare. Anna, don't go anywhere. But there isn't anywhere to go. Yes, good girl, good girl. Oh, <laughs> the day has come at last. I can't help but feel a little uneasy about this. Whatever the witch is planning, it can't be good. Oh no, oh no. Oh. Hello? Is someone there? Uh, hello? Ah! Ah! You can hear me? What is this? You can hear me! Oh boy, I wasn't sure if I'd be able to talk or not. Wow, that sure is a big relief. Is this another one of your tricks, witch? Anna? Oh no, shh! Anna, you gotta be quiet. Anna, who are you talking to? Oh no, oh no! What have I done? This is bad. I... I was talking to... Oh. No one. Just myself. Again. Anna, really? I wish you'd quit doing that already. You're distracting me. Hello? Who... are you? Oh, I'm... I'm... Mm, I'm... Bear? No, wait. That's not right. Be... Ben? Burn? Burshin? Oh, wait! Yes! It's Ben! It's Ben! Wow! I remembered! You... have trouble remembering things? Oh, yeah. Everything from before. I wasn't always like... this. What did you mean, not always like this? Oh, I'm really like you, Anna. You're... a girl? No, yuck! I'm not a girl, silly. I'm a boy. Well, I was a boy when that old woman first brought me here. How long have you been here for? Oh, I'm... I'm not really sure, but it sure feels like a long time. A very, very long time. I tell you, I was so happy when you came, Anna. Finally, a friend. Are you... Did you say you're gonna escape? Shh! Not so loud! So the witch... She did this to you? Turned you into a... Teddy bear? Uh-huh. I, I... I think something went wrong. She screamed and said witchcraft was stupid and... And I was so scared. So I just sat here and tried to stay as still and quiet as possible. Gee, Ben. That's awful. I'm sorry. How long have you been here for? Oh, I'm... I'm not really sure, but it sure feels like a long time. A very, very long time. I tell you, I was so happy when you came, Anna. Finally, a friend. Are you... Did you say you're gonna escape? Shh! Not so loud! This isn't happening. What isn't happening, Anna? This! Me... talking to you. Isn't it? I'm not sure. I suppose it is. I... I think it is, Anna. 
What were you getting so worried about before? Oh, Anna, this is bad. Why? What is she planning? Well, I'm not sure, but it's bad. It's very bad. Just look at what she's done to me. And with that power of yours, she wants to take it from you somehow. I'm sure of it. It's okay, Ben. I'm going to escape. Well, we're going to escape. I'll take you with me. <gasps> I knew it, Anna. I knew it. Oh, but, um, how are we going to escape, Anna? I'm not sure yet. I'm starting to think, though, this power of mine. Oh, yeah, I saw that. That's amazing. You are so clever. Yes, well, I guess I can bend spoons now, but it doesn't seem strong enough to do anything useful. If I could try that machine again, maybe I can make it stronger and... Oh no, Anna. You can't. It's too dangerous. It's all covered in cables and lights and, and, and machine things. Okay. Okay. Let me think about this. That blue light in the headgear thing, that's what seemed to bring this telekinesis out. So then, perhaps there's a way of removing that from the rest of the machine, or perhaps there's a way of controlling it from in here? Oh, Anna, you really are so smart. Uh, but, um, how are you gonna do that, Anna? I'll figure it out. So to escape, I need to... Find out if there's a way to control the machine from here? Yeah. Or at least make that blue light thing happen again. Sounds so simple. I'm going to keep looking for a way out. Oh, this is so exciting!